Did, did I tell you my strange, uh, strange experience uh, in the hot tub the other night with trying to stop the wind with my mind? Did I tell you that story? Well, some of you haven't seen it, heard it, so I'll tell you. So, uh, as many of you know, I have this thought that we're probably in some kind of a software simulation, and I'll spare you the, the long version, but the, the short version is that if anyone can create a, a simulation in which the simulations believe they are real, it probably already happened, and probably happened lots of times. So it's more likely that we're one of the many simulations than one of the original species, and there may be more than one, or more than one original species. But anyway, it's a, it's a sort of a, it's the sort of thing that um, y you wonder about, but there's no way to test, right? You can't really, you can't test whether you're in the simulation. But uh, somebody mentioned to me the other day that my life, in particular, sometimes goes so well that it's like I have the cheat codes to the simulation, or maybe the simulation is just for my benefit or something, because. You know, I was six years old and I said, hey, someday I'd like to be a cartoonist, famous cartoonist living in a big house <laughs> with a pool in the backyard. And I'm literally sitting in a big house with a pool in the backyard. So I was thinking about all these things and it was uh, probably 10 o'clock at night and I was sitting in my hot tub outside just by myself and looking at the wind, and the wind was just ripping. Uh, the, the trees the trees outside were just bending over, you know, shh. So it was like this long gale force wind. And I was thinking about the nature of reality and stuff, and I said to myself, well, if this is a simulation, and I do have access to the cheat codes, because my life seems to have violated so many laws of odds, that it just seems like if anybody had the cheat codes, it would be me. So I thought, well, I'll test this by trying to stop the wind. So I'll just, uh, I'll just say out loud, I'm rewriting the, the script, stop the wind. So I just repeated that a few times. Now, keep in mind, I didn't expect the wind to stop. It's just one of those things you need to check every once in a while to, <laughs> to make sure if you're, you're, you're in a simulation or not. So I, I repeated that a couple of times and, uh, and the wind kept blowing. So I thought, well, okay, I I tested it, and it didn't work. So I thought about something else for a few minutes, and then I looked back at the tree, and the wind had totally stopped. True story. The wind had stopped. <laughs> now, um, I, I want to be super clear here. I'm not saying that we're a simulation and I proved it by stopping the wind. I'm, I'm just telling you a story. <laughs> That's actually what happened. I concentrated on stopping the wind just as a test to see if I could, and, and the frickin' wind stopped. It went from a gale force to, to no wind <laughs> in a few minutes. Now, now, obviously, the rational part of me says that was just going to happen anyway, but it was a fun story. <laughs>